coming at you with another screencast. This one is going to be how to use a webcam on Loom so that you can have your own uh, kind of like document camera and you can go ahead and narrate and write stuff out. This is using Loom with a dot camera. Okay. First thing I'm going to do is I am going to come up here to my browser and I'm going to start Loom. So there's a couple of different ways you can do this. And this is the easiest way that I found. You can see me in the corner down there. Uh, I'm going to start Loom, but I don't want just the current tab. I want my full desktop. That's going to be everything, not just what's in my browser, but what's on the outsides too. It's going to record this whole screen. The next thing I want to do is change my camera source. This camera source is going to be a little bit different. It's going to be my iPivo View 2 camera. Now, once I put my iPivo on, you could see I have a little bit of notes right here. I don't want my iPivo camera to be down here in the corner. I don't like that. So I'm not going to put my iPivo camera here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to keep that on my built-in. Now, I'm going to go to my apps and open the iPivo visualizer. What this is, it's an app that you install on your computer that will let you control your iPivo. Now I'm going to use this app in conjunction with the screen recording I'm doing right now. So I've opened up my visualizer and I'm bringing it into the frame. Uh, it doesn't really look right so I'm going to mess with my visualizer a little bit here and I'm going to turn the camera all the way around. There you go. I like the visualizer for this because I have a lot more versatile settings on my visualizer than I do in just Teams. So I can zoom in, I could zoom out, I could do a whole bunch of stuff. But when my visualizer is open, I can now put my paper down, whatever paper it is. It could be a, a worksheet, it could be anything. So I'm going to put that down and then I can write on this just like a normal doc can. Anything that I write in this area will be recorded during my Loom recording. Once again, all I have to do is hit start recording on this. I'm going to choose the screen that I want to record on. It's going to be this one right here. And there we go. It's going to count me down. Three, two, one. I can get rid of this window and here is my visualizer okay if I get rid of the window you can't see my face anymore if that's a problem for you or you really want your face to show up in your videos that's great I know our kids like seeing our faces uh, all you have to do is put the visualizer on top of on top of the the browser right here make sure your face is still seen make sure your tools are still there and then I can go ahead and write all this off all right, hopefully your writing's a little bit better than mine. I'm not really used to writing on a dot camera. Uh, but like I said, anything you can put on your dot camera, uh, and you can use this dot camera several different ways. I can use this dot camera to look around me. I can move it around. I can do lots of different things. It doesn't just have to sit on top of my desk. But for right now, if you want to use this as a dot cam, if you want to go through some of the lessons or tutorials with your kids right here on paper, you can do that right here using the Loom app, or the Loom app or the Loom Chrome extension up here, Chrome extension, and the iPivo visualizer app that you can download for free at iPivo.com. It's a little bit of app smashing here on uh, the walkthrough. Hopefully you'll do fine. Look at there's my Loom. All right. Hopefully you do fine. If not, we can walk you through all the steps you need to make this successful. Get uh, in touch with me. I'm on Teams almost every day uh, all, or send me an email. I am happy to help. Also, uh, I stole this presentation, uh, the technique from Jackie Larson. So Jackie, you were always one of our biggest uh, attendees at our Tech Tuesdays. It is paying off. You are being adventurous out there and really taking the tech and running with it. Congrats. and You're an inspiration to us all. That's it for me today. Be safe. Be well. Hope you enjoy.